Hi friends, in this lecture we will study about how to find out the general solution of a higher order differential equations. So this is the second shortcut method for finding particular integral pi. So general equation is f of b of y equal to q of x. So generally pi, pi equal to 1 upon f of d into q of x. So in case of either sin ax plus b or cos ax plus b only we are using this method either sin or cos not for all trigonometry functions. Already we have studied about in case of exponential function e raise to x the working process is simply we are replaced d with the coefficient of x. So in case of this either sin or cos we are replacing d square with minus a square not minus a whole square minus a whole square means it is a square but we are replacing d square with minus of a square so that means if minus 2 square means that is minus 4 if minus 3 square means minus 9 like that not 9 or 16 or something so if d cube means we have to write this is d into d square again we are replacing this d square with minus a square d raised to 4 means d square into d square you have to write and replacing d square with minus a square where a is x coefficient so if when this applicable if the denominator is not equal to 0 so in case of see this example 1 upon d square plus 4 sin 2x plus 3 so as per this process we are replacing d square with minus a square a value is 2 so minus 2 square means minus 4 minus 4 plus 4 is 0 when are the denominator 0 same process we are applying what you are applied in first method e raised to x simply we are differentiating this d square plus 4 with respect to capital D. So d square derivative is 2d. So one time we are differentiating means we are multiplying this function with x. So 1 by d means integration we have to integrate this. Similarly suppose d cube plus 4 is there. So already explained this. So d cube is write as d square into d and this d square is replacing with minus a square minus 4 and continue this. So working condition is we are replacing d square with minus a square in case of sin ax plus b or cos ax plus b if the denominator is not equal to 0. If the denominator is 0 we are differentiating f of d with respect to capital D. See one example solve d cube plus 1 of y equal to sin 2x plus 3. So auxiliary equation is we are equating this f of d to 0. So m cube plus 1 equal to 0. So we are using this formula a cube plus b cube. a value is m and b value is 1. So a cube plus b cube equal to a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square. So m cube plus 1 is m, m square minus 1 plus 1. We are equating separately this term to 0 and this term to 0. So m plus 1 equal to 0. We will get m equal to minus 1. So for this we are using the formula of minus b plus or minus root of b square minus 4ac upon 2a. So minus of b value is minus 1 minus of minus 1 plus or minus root of 1 minus 4ac. 4 into 1 into 1. So 1 minus 4 we will get root minus 3. So what is the value of root minus 3 plus or minus root 3i and separate this. So 1 by 2 plus r minus root 3 by 2 i. So these roots are imaginary root. So this is the real root. Therefore complementary function is c1 cos beta x plus c2 sin beta x into e raise to ax. So alpha value is 1 by 2 beta value is root 3 by 2 c1 cos root 3 by 2 x plus c2 sin root 3 by 2 x e raise to 1 by 2 x plus one more root is there c3 e raise to minus x. Now find pi. So pi equal to 1 upon f of d into q of x. q of x is sin 2x plus 3. 
so in case of this we are replacing d square with minus a square so a value is 2 minus 2 square that is minus 4 so first write down this d cube is d into d square so now this d square is replaced with this minus 4 so d of minus 4 means uh, minus 4d plus 1 so write down this is 1 minus 4d so rationalize this function so rationalizing factor is 1 minus 4d rationalizing factor is 1 plus 4d both numerator denominator is multiplied with 1 plus 4d so 1 into 1 plus 4d is 1 plus 4d again it is in the form of a minus b into a plus b so that is a square minus b square a query a square is 1 minus of 4d whole square that is 16 d square again this d square is replacing with minus a square so minus a square is minus 4 that is so 16 into minus 4 so now we have to multiply this 1 into sin 2x plus 4 plus 4d into sin 2x plus 4 so sin 2x plus 4 in denominator minus of minus plus 16 into 4 64 plus 1 65 so here 4d into sin 2x plus 4 so what is d d means d by dx d by d x so that means we have to differentiate this with respect to x so derivative of sin is cos 2x plus 4 into 2 we will get so here already 4 is there so 4 into 2 is 8 so therefore general solution is y equal to cf plus pi so write down the value of cf and write down the value of pi here see one more problem solve d square y by dx square plus y equal to cos x by 2 cos 3x by 2 so first of all this write down in operator form that is we are replacing this is with capital d square d square plus 1 of y equal to cos x by 2 cos 3x by 2 so auxiliary equation is we are equating this to 0 so m square plus 1 equal to 0 so m square equal to minus 1 therefore m equal to plus r minus i so therefore it is in the form of plus r minus beta i so that is c1 cos beta x plus c2 sin beta x so c1 beta value is 1 c1 cos x plus c2 sin x so pi equal to 1 upon f of d f of d is d square plus 1 into q of x cos x by 2 cos 3x by 2 now we have to simplify this by using this formula cos a cos b cos a cos b is 1 by 2 cos a minus b plus cos a plus b so a value is x by 2 b value is 3x by 2 so simplify this x minus 3x denominator is equal we are adding the numerators x minus 3x that is minus 2x upon 2 that is minus x cos of minus theta is cos theta so cos of minus x is cos x plus similarly this 3x plus x is 4x upon 2 that is 2x so write down that value so 1 by 2 cos x plus cos 2x now separate this 1 upon d square plus 4 into cos x plus 1 upon d square plus 1 into cos 2x so 1 by 2 is take here 1 by d square plus 1 cos x plus 1 by d square plus 1 cos 2x again we are using the same process in this we are replacing d square with a square a value is 1 that is minus 1 square so minus 1 square is minus 1 so d square is replaced with minus 1 in case of this so if you are replacing this minus 1 square plus 1 square is 0 so this is the failure case whenever the denominator is 0 we are differentiating this with respect to capital D so d square derivative is 2d so one time you are differentiated means multiply with x so x into 1 by 2d into cos x 1 by d means integration d is the derivative d means d by dx so 1 by d is derivative sorry integration so integral of cos x is sin x so again for this in case of this 
in case of this what is the a value 2 so replacing d square with minus a square that is minus 2 square so minus 2 square means minus 4 remember that not plus 4 we are replacing minus of a square not minus a whole square so that is minus 4 plus 1 that is minus 3 cos 2x so simplify this multiplying this is 2 into 2 4 x sin x minus 1 by 2 into 3 6 cos 2x so therefore general solution is y equal to cf plus pn so solve these examples by using this few suppose in this case so cf is common for any method so sin square is replacing there is no formula for sin square or sin cube only in case of sin ax or cos ax we are replacing d square with minus a square so in this sin square first of all you have to convert this sin square can be write as 1 minus cos 2x upon 2 similarly if cos square is there 1 plus cos 2x upon 2 like that so in case of this sin 2x into cos x convert in this formula sin a cos b formula and simplify this so in case of this we are using the exponential function formula not this 